Alright guys, so it's Goody in the Hoodie and back today. Got a quick dog about video I want to make. Um, who should you pick for the red or blue stone? I will, I didn't bother using, you know, camera because it's kind of glitchy right now, but I will get like, as by my next video, I'm going to do it. Again, I don't know when I'm going to upload these videos, but I'm going to make the video really quick. Who should you pick for the red stone and blue stone? I am going to go for, for JP as well, because you know, it's simple stuff like that. Um, so for both global and JP and the purple stones, I think I said purple stone before. Um, right here and stuff like that. I'll probably upload this in the next few days. Because all units are really good. Okay, so um, I'll go with the redstone first because everybody's going to be like, oh, who should I pick for the redstone? Honestly, go with the choice you feel like. It doesn't matter. Like, for example, um, Super Saiyan, Blue Vegeta, and Trunks. I feel like everybody should have them at least because I mean, you know, the two of some of this stuff like that, you know, they've been featured on tons of banners. Um, I'm going to just run down a little bit. Because um, they've been featured on, like, on 50 banners. Plus, you can get them for free in the barber shop, like, when, um, whatchamacallit. When Saiyan Day came around for Bubble, we got Vegeta instead of, um, you know, Goku and stuff like that. Because everybody loves Goku. We know that. So yeah, um, him, um, I feel like everybody should at least have them both at this point by now, because you can get them for free and stuff like that for like a really long time ago. But like, you know, new players might want to, you know, maybe get them, because they are really both good, so they do kind of support each other with the Vegeta families and stuff like that. So that's really great. Either one, it doesn't matter. They're both really good anyway. Flight Trust may be a little bit more better than Vegeta, but they're both good. Um, STR Gogeta. Maybe get him because he's easy, he's really good, he does a lot of really good damage, especially Rainbow, he does a lot of good damage. I have mine personally, Rainbow. Um, I think I showed him off in a few videos, maybe, I don't know yet, but yeah. Um, Susan 3 Vegeta, not bad, not a bad pick either, I mean, I, his EZA, I mean, a lot of people don't really recognize it, but, um, his EZA is secretly really good, so, yeah, I don't know, for you, I'll probably say maybe Gogeta. Um, Kid Buu, probably not at this point, because he's, he's easy, it's not really good. Um, I'll probably make, I'm not gonna say what Ultimate Gone, he's really good, but maybe, I don't know, because these units you can get them, like, a summons any time of the day. Um, and basically if you're a will and stuff like that. Super Saiyan 3 Goku, he's still good at Disease Day, he's really good, so maybe recommend getting him. These probably, I feel like, maybe get. Um, also, Tech Beers is really good as well. Like, he's really, really good, so if you want, he, he have Bears and stuff like that. He's, like, a good secondary unit. Um, Engine Nepo is really good as well. Um, a lot of people are like, oh, he's the best easy in the game. For me, that only goes for Tech Cell. Um, I'll, I'll get that, I, I'll, I'll get that in there. And Engine Nepo is really good for tanking, dodging, and stuff like that. I feel like he just really is a copy and paste of STR Nepo. But, nah, who cares. Um, anyway, um, if you want to get your Nepo, you go right ahead. For movie bosses like Super Battle Road and stuff like that, oh, he's really good. STR Vegeta, maybe I recommend Kite probably getting him as well. He's really good. Um... Kipu is really great support that unit. Really, really, really probably recommend getting him as well. So we say that Goku is really good though. I mean, I don't see like, a lot of people using nowadays, but he's still a really good unit. Checks out for me, has the best EZA in the game. Him and Ultimate Dawn have to do like, the best EZAs. I feel like for reason it does a little bit as well. But personally for me, I love Texas EZA because as he is like super, as he gets orbs, um, in my opinion, because the more orbs he gets, like tech orbs, it doesn't really matter. But um, for example, his tech orbs, because when you get more orbs in the game, the stronger your opponent um, the card gets. But when you get like tech health, for example, when you get, I mean, he's on the feature on the banner, so probably I feel like wait, summon for really quick. If you want to summon some really quick, if you're waiting for like the last day and stuff like that, but you you can pick these guys up any time of the day until August. I mean, time it's recording, not August, um, October second. But um, yeah, because every time he gets those key spheres, he's gonna get um stronger, stronger. Um, it, it's gonna take. He has save my button super battle rail. So maybe I kind of recommend it for me. Tech Cell has the best easy end game for me anyway, from my perspective. I feel might disagree, but I like it's easy. It's really good. Um. And also we're going again. They they're still on the banner. I feel like kind of wait for it a little while until like you at least because everybody's gonna probably pull fifty of these guys. So I guess wait and stuff like that. Broly he's good for world tournament and stuff like that. He's not as good as our Broly because you're growing as a friend stuff. But there's tons of AOE, especially in the future. They're like um next, I think the next Dragon Fest, very next Dragon Fest. A lot of people are speculating Super Saiyan Goku and um Freeze, um Super Saiyan Goku, the transforming one. Um I I don't know. I mean I'm just saying nothing. So yeah. Um, from my perspective, anyway, from my point of view. Um, but, take well, I mean, this is probably not bad, as, I mean, because there's tons of AOE units you can use for Ultraman, so, I don't know. Um, Full Power Freeze is really good. Um, after his ZZA, he's a really good unit. Ultimate Gone, I mean, I feel like everybody should at least maybe have him as well, because you probably could pull him 20 times on the banner as well. If they've been coming in how units, everybody should at least have them for free, because, again, they give them up for free during, say, day stuff. I know a lot of people have been playing since then, but yeah. Um, and so it's not bad either, so yeah, for both Google and GP, they're really good. I probably recommend getting at least one of these three, maybe, um, Tech Cell, um, and probably maybe, like, one of these, so yeah, and maybe, um, Beerus. So this is it for the rest of them for both Google and GP. This, this is good. I mean, for these guys, they should be, like, they've been on every banner, like, since forever. These guys, when they get through easy A's, it's gonna be destructive. And the rest of you guys are really good. Um, Inka Gita, of course, STR Gogeta is a little bit better, but he's still relatively as a good unit. 
Tay and Goku can't really defend, but maybe not kind of getting him. Oh, this is only if you, if you really just want. Tay Bullet probably not because he is like, I heard like the worst category and stuff like that. He's the worst, like, the leader. Um, 120 leader. I mean, he, yeah, I can, I don't want to say that, but he is good, like, for attack, but his defense just gets molly -mobbed. Physical Cool hasn't really aged badly. He's still good. And SCR you know, engine but it doesn't really matter. Um, and Kid Buu, I like him personally, but a lot of people might not. Not so probably nah. Um, but again, get the unit you feel like it. It doesn't matter. Go with your heart. It doesn't matter. Physical Go Tanks, him and Tech Go Tanks basically have a copy and paste of each other, so it doesn't really matter which one you get. Um, and AGL Super Seventeen, not bad either. But uh, he doesn't really defend like he did before. But yeah, and these guys when they get easy as I feel like maybe get recommend one of these because when they get their easy as especially for Walter, maybe trying to use like key and stuff like that, it really good. And at times recording, JP actually did hit number one in the App Store again, so it's crazy though. So yeah, that's all. Um, all those stuff I just want to go about like that. So they did get also fifty percent stones for hitting seven countries, kind of like how Global did. So yeah, again, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Great life. Great everything. Again, see you guys later. Peace out.